What's up, everybody? We're driving past Solana Beach in California, north of San Diego. Just a beautiful little beach town. Beautiful beaches nearby. You have a beautiful pass towards Del Mar, just south of us. Nice little beach town here, lots of palm trees. Drive a few blocks into this place. Got my phone in. Knows how to ruin a party with laws and regulations about the environment. By the way, if you ever come to California, just remember this. If you ask for a heated pool, ask if every you... pool is heated. Yeah. By the sun. Ask if it is an electric or solar when I go to the front yeah, desk. So, yeah, so yeah, so here's how you ask if your pool is your pool heated in California. Is your hotel pool be heated? Uh, hello, is the hotel pool heated by a electrical pool heater? And then they ask, you mean like the ones that contaminate the environment? And then you have to say yes, one of those. Like not the ones that are solar like by the sun where the sun heats it like no where you use a machine i want it hot because if you ask them if the pool's heated they're always going to say oh yeah it's heated by the sun and then you're like you mean it's solar power like yeah it's it's the sun warms it up yeah i went to one of the like, hotels do you have solar panels yeah. like no we don't have solar panels like yeah. Then it's not a solar heater. But my God, the sun heats it up. Like, you're just trying to tell me you were... Okay, here, the reality is this. You're not going to say... You're not going to install a pool heater. So, in order to not install a pool heater, you're going to tell me that it's for environmental purposes. They don't give a crap about the environment. They're saving $5,000 by installing a pool heater and then, like, another 50000 by not having to heat it to hang around electricity to the pool. Actually, the the solar panel costs more money. Yeah. So, that's... The, when you come to California, what I've realized is... Like, we went to the Starbucks. Mm -hmm. One Starbucks didn't have chairs and tables. Because there's so many homeless people. So now you can't sit down and have your Starbucks. But that saves them $5,000 every three years. They don't have to have chairs and tables. Then we go to another Starbucks, like... They don't give you napkins and straws unless you ask for them. They have a sign at the window saying, if you need a straw that contaminates the environment and can choke out a turtle, ask for Just a straw. Just let me have a dick straw. Uh, so now they don't have to give you a straw. So now I'm in my, I'm, I'm drinking the Starbucks and I'm like, how the crap do I drink the Starbucks without a straw? They're like, sir, you can just take the lid off. Matter of fact, we're not going to give you a light. That saves us another $50 million. Although, I will say the other one I went to, mm -hmm. uh, they were like, yeah, do you want a straw, ma'am? I was like, yes, I do. Thank you so well, much for asking. It's pretty simple. Yeah. Okay. They don't care about the environment. You know what they care about? Money. Money. Not giving you a straw. If, they, if, if every, You know how much money they save by not giving you a straw? Mm -hmm. uh, in a year, I bet they probably spend like $15,000 on straws or something. Like yeah. Ridiculous. You know? So now they don't have to give you a straw. Now they don't have to have a pool heated because it's solar heated. Now you go to a hotel. You can't get a straw. You can't get a pool heater. If it's a hot drink, I don't care about the adult sippy cup thing. But if it's a cold drink, I, I want on. a straw. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's ridiculous. But and then, I love how they always put like a, it's for the environment. That's not for the environment. It's it's for the, it's for the freaking profit of your company not having to give me a straw. Because it's really like, I can see right through it. And because they're, they're never doing something for the environment where it costs them money. They're doing something for the environment where it saves them money. And if I'm eating food, I want a napkin. I mean, is it really yeah. that ridiculous to give me a napkin with oh! my food? Okay, they're not ever, I haven't seen a single thing in California for the environment that costs money. Everything I've seen for the environment are things that save money, which is very hypocritical, by the way. 
So, like, what do you want me to do? Wipe it on my clothes so it saves you money? Yeah. I haven't seen a single thing for the environment that saves money. I mean, that costs money. I mean, if you want to conserve water, I mean, you'd give me the napkin. <coughs> what aggravates me is the hypocrisy of the whole thing. Yeah. Because it's like, everywhere you go, there's cost-saving measures that are ridiculous. But as long as they slap a, it's for the environment on it, you're good to go. And I think it'll get more ridiculous when we get into L.A., and then when we leave LA, it'll get yeah. a little less ridiculous. All I know, it's it's ridiculous, and every single thing that I've noticed is really a wow. Look at this view. Yeah. It's really a cost-saving measure. Nothing more than that. Yeah. Uh, it's just like wow. Mm -hmm. Unbelievable. environmentally friendly thing it, to me it seems like a load of crap okay we are entering cardiff by the sea yep. 